Yes, it's me, Market Vendor here again today. But listen, today I want to talk a little bit about curfew. Curfew. Or as the French used to call it, cover foot. You know, that's the Belgian pronunciation, but it's fairly close to the French one here, we're telling you. Now, apparently the origin of this word, curfew, got to do with uh, a French word, two French words, cover foot. C-O-U-V-R-E-F-E-U. That's how they pronounce it. Now, you see me, Market Vendor, I went check on this thing. No, it really mean cover the fire, but don't the fire. What exactly is that? What fire you put in out? No, in the old time days, before we had gas lamps and then before we had electricity, you used to have these fires burning in the houses. And around nine o'clock at night, you used to hear a fella guy round, balang, 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 yes. Balang is what I said, yes. Round eight or nine o'clock, reminding you to put out the fires, you understand? You know, yes, because you see a lot of the houses, the timber houses back in the day. And you never know, you might burn down your house and the, and the people house next door and a whole heap of houses if you left on that fire burning during the night. So you had to have the curfew. Eh. Well, you know, a curfew today be restricting your movements. But again, generally speaking, it has got to do with night time, ain't it now? Yes, night time is when you say about curfew most of the times, but... Not always, you know. Yes. Not my friends in Trinidad and Tobago, though. <laughs> what else? I know some PNM is can cost market men to know, you know. Oh, lost. But anyhow. But I, I found it a little bit odd that Trinidad and Tobago had a curfew that start at 10 a.m. Huh? Not 10 p.m. <laughs> my Trini. You're not back now. Well, you're different, yes? <laughs> The curfew start at 10 o'clock and end at 5 o'clock the next morning. So essentially you have five hours during the two bank holidays this week to go out and conduct your business, go and do whatever it is you got to do. I would suggest don't even hold a fresh during that period. Well, well, well. That's a real unusual time there. In Barbados, normally the curfew to start, but here around, in some cases it start as early as 9 o'clock. And then it went up to like 10 o'clock, then 11 o'clock, and some nights is midnight, you know, and then a few nights you ain't got the curfew at all, at all, at all. Hey, hey, but not Trinidad and Tobago, boy, not my Trini friends, no, no, no. Uh, the government don't there come up with <laughs> curfew at 10 o'clock by the two by holidays. We ain't had much for Indian arrival there, did you? Uh, but where you could really get done in that time, though, hmm? You can go to the supermarket, the bank, and everything. If it's 5 o'clock in the morning, bank it opening before about 8 o'clock. Unless they got special opening hours, huh? And they're going to get special passes to go by the priority bus route and be by the roads and so on. And then what about the taxis that go and get into them places? That's a real unusual curfew here with market telling you. Five hours by them two days? Well, you better stay home here we're telling you. Huh? And order and hope that KFC or somebody sort of deliver. Hey, hey, I was only a market vendor. I want my trendy friends to attack, attack umbrage at this area, you know. I ain't jabbing you too strong. I just find that real odd hours. Them is the oddest, you know, curfew hours I ever hear about in the Caribbean. Anyhow, generally, as I say, it got to do with night time. But they not any regulations that say it can be at a different time. I had a fellow down in Grenada when they had the uprising and what he called, well, you know, the revolution and thing. I went to the overthrow of Morris Bishop. A fellow called, he called himself General, General Hudson Austin. But he couldn't even call the world curfew. He used to call it curfew. I you like, what, curfew? What kind of fufu business this is? I was only a market vendor, but I'm gone for now. You have a blessing and a wonderful day, yeah? <laughs> I like my curfew now, yeah?